guys, it's me, Teacher Sam. Second video today, and this is a palfish video. I'm not in my classroom today. I've been traveling for a few days. And like 99% of the time, there are some rumors that need to be um, explained. There are some rumors that need to be squashed. I feel like that's most of my job. <laughs> It's just setting rumors straight. And I know that happens when you have a lot of people who work in a space together. So this morning, um, a fellow mentor came to me and was like, hey, have you heard this rumor? And after we started like laughing and cutting up about it, I wanted to test the theory that all these teachers had. And then I wanna explain how these rumors really get started. So, a fairly new teacher uh, posted in an admin group this morning, well, I guess it was last night, Beijing time, and said, hey, did you know we could pay our students to stay on our class roll? What? Okay. In the chat function with your students, if you hit the plus sign at the bottom, it gives you a few options. And I think you can, let me grab my camera, my phone. All right, so if I go in here and I'm gonna look at my student and I'm going to use mentor Melissa, okay, as the person I'm going to chat with, okay? So let me pull up Melissa's profile and I'm going to show you guys what happens because teachers are saying that you can send your students money and that will convince them to stay in your list and it's not true it's not true at all okay so this is her chat and it's let me see if I can change my resolution okay you can see this is our chat there's a plus sign right there and these it says photos camera dialogue or transfer if you click transfer it comes up like this like you could send money right that's kind of cool it even has is alipay paypal or wechat so i'm gonna go in here and i'm gonna say I'm going to send Melissa a dollar just to test the theory. Okay. So I'm going to click transfer. I'm going to click one RMB and PayPal message error message. It says, sorry, it's not available in teacher's version. If needed, you can download the parent version. We all know that there are numerous numerous palfish apps okay including a parent version and a student version that is only available to parents who send money to their students their children right guys do you really think that palfish would let us pay students i mean come on no, you cannot pay students to stay on your on your time roll, your class roll. Now let's talk about how these weird rumors get started. So someone's messing around in the app. They find something they don't exactly understand, such as the transfer button. Then they go into a admin chat, and rather than just say uh, to the mentor, "Hey, can you help me with this?" They say, hey, so what, can we pay for students now? And that's how we tracked this back to a conversation between two fairly new teachers who didn't understand the app. And rather than going to someone and asking for help, they chose to try and make it a very public situation. So that's what happened. They said that in one admin group and then a newer teacher than them even picked up on it and went to another admin group. And then that admin group had 300 people who picked up on it and went to this admin group and that admin group and this chat group and that chat group and Facebook. 
So then we have a thousand teachers wondering how do they pay for students and putting down the company because someone didn't understand part of the app. So guys, I'm going to give you a piece of advice. Number one, if it sounds silly, it probably is. Okay. It's probably not true or it's being misconstrued. Number two, if you have a question about how something operates, why something is the way it is, reach out to your mentor. If you can't get your mentor, my mentor name is down below. You have mentor Leanne who answers questions, US Angel, Melissa, we answer questions all of the time. These little bitty questions get blown up when people maybe only see part of a conversation or they don't understand why something is there. The next thing we know, we have teachers up in arms, ready to quit, threatening to walk away, accusing the company of doing horrible things. Guys, come on. That little comment this morning then led to uh, teachers accusing Palfish, uh, Palfish of allowing pedophilia. Obviously, that doesn't happen. We all know this app is very censored. Yes, there are some weird creepers who try and talk to teachers. Report, report, and they're gone. But there's never, right, there's never anything like that with students, okay? Come on, guys. Let's remember we are still professionals, okay? If you hear something that's silly, ask about it. Not in a big public forum. If you hear something that maybe doesn't sound right, reach out to a mentor. That's what we're here for. Okay, guys, it's time for me to go. I hope to see you in my classroom very soon. Bye!